Hey guys, I'm going to be doing another review today uh, of another Dollar Tree item. This is the Swedish Fish Lip Balm. Um, I tried it yesterday when I bought it and I usually don't buy lip balms from Dollar Tree but I love Swedish Fish, the candy, so I try, yeah, I decided to give this a try. Um, it doesn't smell to me, it doesn't smell that much like Swedish Fish. It has a, a slight scent and the scent that it does have doesn't smell that much like Swedish Fish and it has a slight um, like flavor to it too but the flavor to me tastes bad doesn't taste like Swedish Fish or it tastes like something like like art very artificial Swedish Fish flavor and I would say neither one the scent or or the taste is that strong but the scent uh, but the taste I mean is stronger than the scent the flavor is stronger than the scent but like I said, um, when you open it up first, you can even barely smell it. I mean, you have to put it right underneath your nose. And it doesn't have that much, like I said, of, of, of the same good uh, scent as the Swedish Fish candy. But the, on the plus side, it's very moisturizing. So if you're just looking for something to moisturize your lips, you know, if you, if you suffer from dry lips, I don't. I just got it, you know, for the flavor this would be good for you then if you don't care you know about the flavor and the scent that much but that's like I said that's on the plus side it does really moisturize it's really keeps your lips really moist but for the flavor it's not it doesn't taste that good and the scent is not that strong so it's up to you if you'd want to try it for yourself or not I wouldn't buy it again especially now that everything's a dollar twenty-five I wouldn't buy it for a dollar twenty-five so yeah guys thanks for watching bye